Welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Cassie here and today we are finally gonna reveal our new SUV and if you guys been staying tuned in you know that me and Kevin we went to the dealership the other day and we flipped a coin for a good deal on this SUV. We're in here babe. You want to let them know what you think about it? I think it's a very nice car. I've never seen a car with this many features in my life. Ever like ever and then for, for it to be a kia that's actually saying a lot so it's a very nice car when i say very nice car this is a well suv this is a very nice suv and cassandra she wants to get ready for a family a big old family so i mean yeah i've been looking into getting a new suv a new car and we've shopped around probably for the last six months if you are a subscriber to our channel you know we've checked out the tesla we've checked mm. out other cars and honestly even though those are really nice luxurious cars this kia telluride is the best car with all the features that you can think of literally i'm about to blow your mind with all the features that this car has and on top of that this is a very comfortable car affordable uh, affordable and mm -hmm. very spacious so even though we don't have kids right now we definitely are planning on having kids so we yeah. we are we got the room y'all we got the room mm -hmm. i mean as you can tell the seats are lovely i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys from the outside and this is a car tour this is our new suv this is our new daily um mm. babe are you gonna miss your hellcat or are you still gonna drive your hellcat or what like mm, what? i'm never gonna stop driving my hellcat you're never gonna stop driving your hellcat never. no it's that much fun. all right what would you rate this compared to the hellcat like one what? to ten what, as far as driving yeah one to ten like one to overall anything period one to okay. ten what would you give my car and what would you give your hellcat on a driving i would probably give this like a two as far as driving, Hellcat, uh, I, what? I, I, yes, yeah, so the drive, the drivability is car like a two, like it's. I mean, horrible. are you talking about horsepower? Yeah, I am. Okay, he's just talking about horsepower. Okay, it is a This isn't a car. race car, so okay, you know, okay, overall, because we're not talking about horsepower here. Overall, okay. overall, without horsepower, I would have yeah. to give it like a five. A five. I would have to give it like a five. Okay. Like we're, we're You're all, giving my Kia Telluride a five yeah, out of ten? Yeah, yeah, because so, what? Because look, it's, it's not yeah. it's not all about speed. But I need to get he's up been hating out. since day one. It's all right though. I need to get up. Like sometimes you might need to press on the gas. When you press on yeah. the gas, you ain't going nowhere. All right, I'm gonna but, show you guys how my Kia Telluride is the top SUV of all time right now on the market. Awards. A num oh. num. This car is a ten. All right. For Kevin, he thinks it's a five, but like, y'all see, he loves it. Yeah, if we talking it. about if we talking about features, my Hellcat would probably be like a four. Okay, this Telluride would be like a ten. Thank All you. Right? About time you give we it a little credit. About, we talking about give it a little credit. And, it and it looks nice too. You can't yeah, lie. All right, so now let's get into the details and mm -hmm. yeah, let's do it. So mm -hmm. if you guys guessed the Kia Telluride, you are correct. Somebody in the last video said it's a Kia Telluride. Yes. Ooh. You got it. It is a Kia Telluride. Now, this is not just any Kia Telluride that I got, all right? Mm -hmm. This is the top level, top trim level. This is a 2021 Kia Telluride SX Prestige Package Nightfall Edition. Ooh, yes. that's a mouthful. It's a mouthful because it is a mouthful. And it's okay. The whole mother it's the whole package. And what makes it a nightfall? Okay, so the nightfall edition is this right here. Ooh. So this girl, as you can see, all blacked out. Uh -huh. You got the Kia 3D symbol. It's okay. all blacked out. Ooh. The word Telluride is all blacked out. Sorry, Ooh. there's a helicopter right over us right now. So give it a second. All right, so the helicopter's gone. But the Kia Telluride Nightfall Edition Ooh. is in all black trim. So as you can see, it Ooh. has black and even down here, it's also blacked out. Okay. And it has these amber lights. When it's lit up, it'll have like an orange mm -hmm. liner around it, Ooh. which is pretty cool. Turn and them on. Turn them on. Once you, um, here, let me unlock it. There you Ooh, go. Uh, Ooh. So that's what I'm talking about right Fire. There, right? Super hot fire. fire. Also, the tires, mm -hmm. the rims, they're 20 inch alloy wheels. So alloy, that, alloy, <laughs> alloy. Uh huh. Alright, so then you come around. Come on, let's get to it. So it has a black trim, so mm -hmm. it'll have all this blacked out. On the mm -hmm. bottom, at so. The top. Uh -huh. It also comes with the crossbars. Not all Telluride's come with the crossbars. Mm -hmm. but mine did. Yep. 
Yeah. So pretty much what she's saying is that everything that's in black would normally be like in chrome or like silver. So the knife all package makes it like all black trim and everything. So yeah. And we get to the back, and as you can see, this is an all wheel drop. Ooh. That's a hot thing for me because now I can't wait to maybe we can take it to the snow. Uh huh. Bring you directly to the snow. Okay. Which is one key feature that I really love because I can mm -hmm. take my baby straight to the snow. Park. Yeah. So the yeah. back is Ooh. also all blacked out, and this is also a special package where it comes with a tow hitch. Okay. Like, okay. Okay. So it comes with the tow. So if we ever need to tow any extra things, like a big wheelchair or something. Yep. That's Super sized wheelchair. So it has a button to pop uh -huh. the open, and honestly, Ooh. I'm showing you guys this first because this is what I fell in love with. All right. Mm. Me and Kevin, when we travel, we travel with a lot of things. Yeah, and my wheelchair. Hellcat can't carry everything. It can't. It was holding what? up. It was holding we up. It up. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So this right here, I love it. Um, I can Ooh. pop these, this back row, which is the mm -hmm. third row. I can pop it down. I can pull Sexy. this down. And it'll just... Yeah, I can see my wheel. Damn. My wheels have marked it up a little yes. bit. So it's been, I got this car a few days ago. I want to say mm -hmm. this is probably like my fourth, fourth day? day. Okay. Yeah, it's my fourth day with this car. Okay. So I'm showing you guys for Yeah, Ooh, Ooh. I love it. All right, a lot of the SUVs I looked at in the past didn't have enough room in mm -hmm. the back. So even SUV, some SUVs like the BMWs, okay. like the Tesla, mm. um, they had a third row. Yeah. Now, when you put the third row up, you don't have enough room like this. Yeah. This this room right here, you didn't have this room in mm -hmm. a BMW or any other SUV. So this is right here, a key thing that I really loved. Mm -hmm. I could fit a wheelchair right here. I could probably Ooh. break down your wheelchair, fit it right here, and then mm -hmm. we can also pack some stuff down there. Oh. Because they got a little space down there. So okay. this is some extra space. So okay. this spacious, just mm -hmm. spacious, it blew my mind. So mm -hmm. that's why I had to get this car. And I think we should also show them like a like like a video of my wheelchair being inside of here oh, yeah, we at will. the same time okay we're gonna show you that okay so easily you can put this pull this and and it'll go down and then okay. you can also put down the front rows y'all see that Ooh, that was quick with, with the yeah, button yeah with the button so with the button down, and then you got this little volt I that's know. hard i don't Man. know you got this little volt so if okay. you need to use it charge this, something up you can adjust so whenever you want to close okay it, so can, somebody in a wheelchair like me they got long arms yeah you can lower it you can lower it down okay hold it three seconds Ooh. one two three Okay. And it'll lock it in place. So the next time when you open it, it ain't lock it in place. It ain't lock. Oh, it'll, oh. It'll, it'll stay right here. It won't go any higher. Oh, okay, okay. I was thinking it was gonna close. Now, now, can you close it with that button as well? Yeah, you can close it. Ooh. So then, and the next time you open it, it'll come back to that same level. So you can adjust it to your height. Okay. My name yours. Ooh. Another cool feature that I really love about the SUV is that, hold on, before you get in the car, let me show them, okay, babe? So, this, once you come in here, you see this handle right here? I love, love, love this handle. This car also has top handles up here, kind of a little dark, but you so can- that's one reason why we didn't go to Tesla. One reason why we didn't go to Tesla is because the Tesla does not have top handle. Yeah, it doesn't have the top handle grab bars and it doesn't have this, none of that. Yeah. None on top of that, it had some really hard seats. These are Napa leather, soft, comfortable. And the seats right here, mm -hmm. the seats more so curved up. So on the Tesla? Yeah, it was like it was like it curved up. On the Tesla, so yeah. It was like it made it that much harder to transfer. And yeah, you don't want to rub your butt on that every time you you know try to get in. This one, on the other yeah. hand, is a lot smoother. I put my legs up in there like that. Yeah. You know, like, oh, David, you look at hot. Yeah, you look at hot. Yes. So. I mean, it's still a little difficult, but it's not as difficult. Yeah. See, yeah. he uses the top handle yeah. and. Yeah. Helps him pull up, and then yeah. Not that bad. Not, Not that bad. bad. Yeah, can't be accessible, yeah. if you ask me. Okay, Ooh. so what do you think about the room up there, though? The room. Oh, oh, this is definitely spacious. It's spacious. Very, you, are it's you comfortable? Very, yeah, very spacious. Very comfortable. Uh, 
I have no complaints. No complaints. I have all no right. Complaints. So let's get in the car and show them all the details from the inside. Ooh. Before I get into the car, I want to show you guys how I put Kevin's wheelchair in here. So one thing that I really love about it is that I don't actually have to break down Kevin's wheelchair piece by piece, meaning I can keep both his tires on the wheelchair. And I took the cushion off just to make it easier for me to fold fold down. So once I did that, you honestly all I have to do is lift it up and put it in the back and just slide it in there and it fits perfectly i do want to add some suvs have space back there you, you know they it, it has enough space to put the wheelchair back here all put together but one downfall on a lot of them was that the car was sitting up a little bit too high so this SUV doesn't sit too high from the ground. So I don't have to lift the wheelchair super high up. I'm short, so I can't be lifting the chair way over my head just trying to put it inside the SUV. So this is another lovely small detail and major difference that I love about this SUV is that it sits, it sits at a moderate level, not too low, not too high, and I'm able to slide Kevin's wheelchair right in and it fits perfectly. And then all I have to do is press the button and then it closes. Ah, amazing. I love it, I love it, I love it. All right, so now let's get into the inside. In this video, I might miss out on some features. That's how many features this car has. But some of my top favorite features on this Kia Telluride is one, the heating and the cooling seats. So the two front seats up here, you can warm them up during the winter or cool them off during the summer. And if you live in Bakersfield, Bakersfield gets like scorching devil hot during the summer. Mm. Cooling seats is gonna be amazing definitely a must with leather seats so i'm gonna love that feature and not only are they in the two front seats they're also in the captain seats that i have back here so there's captain seats up here i mean behind us and those also feature the cooling and the heating seats which i love another thing i really love about the telluride is that it has a what is it called, babe? Heads up display. Heads up display. I always yeah. forget what it. I always forget what it's called, but it's a heads up display. Mm -hmm. All right, and y'all can see it right there. Y'all see it? It's at zero miles per hour because I'm just sitting in the same spot. But once I drive, that will tell me the speed limit of the street and also my current speed. On top of that, you see the two little it's it's very light but you can see the two fainted lines on there it also lets you know if you do go out your lane it'll start beeping and push you back into your lane so i love the heads up display another feature this kia telluride has is the uvo system the uvo is pretty much a kia telluride program that you kind of add onto your phone it's an app and mm -hmm. you're able to lock your car start your car yeah. you're you're able to set the temperature to whatever temperature you want once you mm -hmm. remote start it and it lets you know where your car is at if you ever go do valet it, mm -hmm. it lets you know uh, where it's at if it's locked if somebody's driving it how fast how they're going, fast they're going. How much gas you got to uh, empty yes everything. you can literally check everything on your phone and I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys this is right here my Kia Telluride and it lets me all all, lets me know all the details so that is a cool feature about my car and this is the da the monitor dash what, what would you call mm -hmm. it babe mm -hmm. you're the car expert <laughs> The I monitor? Like the LED screen. The LED yeah, screen? Yeah, I like the LED screen. Okay, so we got the LED screen. Now let me go ahead and show you guys some of my favorite features. Ah, I could cry. So we have obviously the maps. And another thing is you can adjust this whole home screen to whatever you go to the most. So obviously everybody kind of goes to the maps, music. It also tells you the weather. You could swipe and then it takes you on into all the other details of the car. I have Apple CarPlay which connects once I connect my phone with the USB. USB. This is the UVO link pretty much of that tells you all about the car the radio the media It has voice recognition. So if you want to call somebody this is a secret feature of this car is okay. that it has sounds of nature So if you feeling like you've been having a rough day and you need something to calm you down You just come in here and yep Listen to a rainy day Cafe. You gotta oh, yeah, you can listen to a cafe 
warm fireplace. Click the first one, Lively Forest. I've never in my life, never in my life, seen anything like this in a car. Snowy village, oh! This is amazing. You want the snow vibe? Let's yeah. I also heard is that it has quiet mode. Quiet mode is when, let's say for example, when we have babies, right? Okay, okay. When we have babies, mm -hmm. and me and you are listening to music, right? But the baby mm -hmm. back is back there asleep, right? Okay. Quiet mode turns off the speakers in the back and keeps them on in the front so I it'll keep everything that. if somebody is back there sleeping or if okay. our baby's sleeping you know the back will stay quiet and yep. it will only play in the front okay. so that is a super cool feature the back seats also have ac and all that good yep. stuff back there stuff. i'm sitting in the back seat right behind the driver's side and these are the captain seats so there's these are captain Ooh. seats they also have a little armrest okay and back here you also have this cool little neat little charger so so if I have a phone, I can charge my phone without having to disturb anybody in the front. You know, okay. There's, um, there's a little hook right there. So if I have my purse or if I go shopping, I can hook it up on there. It's just a little hook, nothing too major. Mm -hmm. Up here, I also have my own AC, my own heater, my own ventilator, little thingies. Check this out. The car also comes with some ambient lights. So right now it's on green and they're all lit up right around so you can see it that's a pretty neat feature that this suv has i also have a sunroof back here this is the one in the back this one doesn't open up this is more of just a standstill uh, sunroof the one in the front however you can open that all the way up and then manually close it you want to show them how to go mm -hmm. so you manually close like that and yeah look at this watch this and watch then this. Okay. we're back here you guys so with the ambient light uh-huh let me know what color y'all want. Y'all want red? Let's see. Y'all want red? Give you red. It turned Ooh, out. Ooh. you turned it oh. red. Y'all want golden? Golden. Golden. Oh. Y'all okay. want the refreshing sea? Yes, yeah, refreshing sea. Oh. Oh, 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 you know what? You want blue? Yes. Oh, Ooh. I like the blue. You know I like the blue. You know what? You, you know what? You want custom? Uh -huh. You want custom? Okay. Uh -huh. Green. Oh, yeah. I want a pink. A pink. 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 I got you the pink. I got you the pink. pink. You ready? Oh. That's a little there purple. Go. Go but purple. Purple. No. Pink. Shut up, pink. Yeah, pink. Pink. Oh, that's ah, pink. That's pink. Right yes, there. I like, right. yeah. Got you with the red. Oh, I like the red. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh. oh, I like that one. Oh, oh that's hard. Is it changing? Oh, you're that's changing it. it, babe. Yeah, I am. Oh, my God. It's... Look, watch it. Look. Boo. Ooh. All the colors. Oh, all the colors. my Look. God. I love Let's it. Go. This, oh, this is like the, the best. Colors feature ever that's, 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 that's the best hard. feature ever i'm not gonna Ooh. lie i'm not gonna lie that's the best know, feature right? ever ah! all right so you guys this is the whole infotainment system right here you got individual heating and cooling which is amazing because she like to be cool i like to be warm can i add something in okay there? go ahead say. another neat feature that the kia telluride has is that you can set your temperature to what you want it on every single time you turn it on so if i won't always Ooh. want it to turn on to 70 degrees, mm -hmm. you know, with AC, I can set it and it's okay. Easy. Okay, and then look down here, you guys. Look at this right here. Look, check this out. You can change the drive modes. So, say you wanted to drive in comfort, you put it in comfort. Say you want to put it in sport, you want to go a little fast, like you ain't got that much horsepower. You can go ahead and put it in sport. They got smart driving where I believe that it learns how you drive and like it adjusts like that. You got eco, which is what you kind of should drive in. And also, last but not least, say we drive, let me see. And also, last but not least, say we driving in the snow, we got the snow. And this button right here, say you want to view the camera on here instead of that. Now, this only works up to like 14 miles an hour, but say you want to do it, you press it, bam. That, that turns on right there. So, look, you also got a 360 view from the top of the vehicle. This is a front view of the vehicle. So, there's cameras all around this vehicle. And, babe, show them all the other cameras that they got. Come right on. Here. Come so, on. Go. Oh. Oh. That's a side view. view. What? Front view. Where are the cameras? Oh, yeah, this is the back view. I, Yo, I no, no, that's the front, but up top. Oh, that's like a zoomed in version of the top. I think of that's the front. it. I think that's it. Okay, this is just to adjust. And this okay, is, okay, these are just settings so where you can do like a top mm, view. Okay, default, whatever. Okay, and now look, say right here, say she's driving right mm -hmm. here, right? S say you're driving, and I like, say you want to stop it. All you gotta do is press that up. 
and it automatically puts the car in like park until yeah. you like press it down and stuff mm -hmm. like that. So that's, that's like actually for pretty lazy cool. People. Yeah, kinda. Or if you're at the drive thru and you're waiting a long time. True. And like Instead True. Of, you, know, you can put it in park. So. Mm -hmm. And also, one other feature, y'all see my phone right down there? Look. Oh, it's it's yes. actually charging How up. How did I forget that feature? It's charging up my phone. I totally forgot about that Look, feature. My it phone is, is charging, charging up. Yeah. Look. So this is a charging pad, you guys. Y'all yep. know what a charging pad is. You can wireless. put your, it's a wireless charging pad. Pad. You can put your phone on there and it will charge your phone, which I mm -hmm. totally love, 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 Look, love. It's charging on my phone right now. Yeah. That's actually pretty dope. Yep. And we got two cup holders right here. Yep. A little Ooh. container right here. You, can put you know what? You know what? This is our hand sanitizer container right yeah. there. Yeah. We'll throw it in there. My bad. My bad. Go back. Yeah. Ooh. Okay. We COVID-19 ready. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, and then this is just the middle console. This is a pretty cool thing, too. You can remove this. Mm, and then I've, okay. I've been keeping my little... Oh, my little, oh, little, ooh, little, little okay. ooh. And it does have a little USB connector in there also. Okay. But, um, this thing is equipped. Yes, but I love it. And there's also two cup holders right here behind okay. the middle console for people in the back. Mm. And other than that, that is pretty much some of the top main features of this car, babe. Yep. You want to tell them anything that you love? Anything else about the car? Mm. I don't know. Well, you also got like you know like the voice oh, control yes. and everything on the actual steering wheel, so that's actually pretty cool. But I mean, I'm pretty sure you guys know that. But some of my top features has to be like the lighting. I like the lighting, and I also like the heads-up display. Uh -huh. I think that the heads-up display is like amazing, Let and me also right here. and also the cameras everywhere. The, the cameras everywhere is something that I kind of wish like the Hellcat had. Oh, yeah. Like you know, I'm driving a hundred thousand dollar vehicle, and there there's not even a tenth of the features yeah. that this car has. Like this car has so many features that I mean we really can't even explain it in like one whole video. Yeah, we can't. So, we, we definitely missed a lot of features on this car and, and we're still learning. We're still learning all this is, stuff. Yeah, this is only our fourth day with the car so we're still learning a lot of the things. But mm -hmm. in all I really in, I love this car because it's honestly accessible for my husband. That is what sold me the car is yep. that it's accessible for my husband. My husband's able to get in and out of this SUV he has handlebars all around mm -hmm. and even if he does decide to drive it one day I'm gonna feel totally comfortable because there's so many things on this car that will prevent a car crash another thing it's just spacious for us to mm -hmm. be able to go on road trips we'll be able to take your wheelchair yeah when we have extra, kids and any extra things to mm -hmm. any extra tires you might need for your wheelchair when we have kids honestly this is why I got the SUV because mm -hmm. it is wheelchair accessible handicap cap accessible and i honestly if you are looking for a new suv definitely check out the kia telluride they have different um different trim levels and mm -hmm. you will honestly love it and, and as it sits i know you guys have been waiting for this as it sits and i'm going to give you guys the good the bad and the ugly okay as it sits this car everything with all the options that it has and everything this car right here costs fifty thousand four hundred and five dollars now i'm gonna be honest with you guys babe do you want to tell them the scary thing that's going on with this car right now no, I, what's this? okay so i guess the scary thing for me would be that some dealer some no dealer not ships, some all all all, all dealerships all. all right well all dealership but not the one i went to and no all, no no <laughs> they was too all the dealerships are charging about twelve thousand dollars over sticker over so for kia people are paying sixty two thousand dollars for this mm -hmm. SUV when it's 50 yep. msrp so. 50 msrp now we went there we got they was advertising it at fifty seven thousand uh, you want to tell them what we end up getting for uh, how much did we end up getting over for? Fit, you guys. I'm, I'm bad with numbers. She didn't do, she didn't do the negotiating. <laughs> I did the negotiating. Now, I'm not going to lie. It was some, there was, there was some dealerships where I called and I attempted to, to negotiate over uh -huh. the phone. Uh -huh. It was like, sorry, no, somebody's going to come in and buy it. Like yeah. somebody's like for real for, and it was just like, what? Not even like $8,000 over no, like they was not having it, not negotiating. These vehicles are only standing on the lot for like seven days. We ended up getting this car for fifty four thousand. It was actually pretty cool. We uh, our APR is a one point nine. So, but that's what happens when you have good credit. We like you guys exceptional credit. Exceptional credit. <laughs> Look, take care of your credit, okay? Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, it takes one thing to mess it up. 
10 years to fix yeah pretty much guys, thank you so much for watching this mm -hmm. video hopefully you guys enjoyed our car tour make sure you guys subscribe to our channel like this video if you enjoyed it shout out to you guys who guessed the car correct it's, mm -hmm. it's a white car with the beige inside yeah and a kia telluride and i am so in love my baby loves that i know it and yeah. um that's it so until next time i hope you guys have a great day peace Got to let it go